Welcome to the channel. In this tutorial, we will see how we can add Python installation location to the path environment variable. So if you have already installed Python and forgot to update the path environment variable in the installer, then this is how you guys can set it up. Now here I'm assuming that you guys have installed Python in your computer, but forgot to update the path environment variable. Now, the first thing that we do is we will make sure that path environment variable is not updated with Python installation location. To check that, we will click on the start button and we will search for CMD. We will open up the command prompt and here we will type in Python space minus minus version and we will hit the enter button. Now here, if Python is installed and path environment variable is updated, then you will see the Python version number, but it is not displaying anything here. It means that if Python is installed, then path environment variable is not updated. We will close the command prompt. Now the next thing that we have to do is we have to open up the folder where Python has been installed in this computer. So here, what you have to do is you have to double click on this PC and you have to open up the file explorer. Normally when you install Python with default settings, Python is installed in the C drive or whatever the drive name is where the operating system is installed. In my case, the Python is installed in the C drive, local disk C. So here I'm gonna open up local disk C and before continuing, we have to make one more setting and that is in the top, we can see three dots. If I take my cursor, it says see more. We just have to click on that. It will open up a menu and we can find options. We need to click on that. It will open up folder options window. Here, we need to click on view tab and we need to check the radio button which says show hidden files, folders and drives. And after that, we can click on apply and we can click on OK. Now in my C drive, I can see that some of the hidden files are visible. Now we have to open up the users folder and then we can find a folder with the user account name. Here in my case, my user account name is Anil Shetty and that folder is visible here. In your case, it will be different with whatever the username that you have. So you have to open up that folder. And after that, you will find a folder called as app data. It is a hidden folder. Open it up and then you will find local. Open it up and then you will find programs. Open it up and then you will find Python. Open it up and then you will find a folder with the name Python and some number. This number can be different and this number is nothing but the Python version which is installed. Here I have installed Python 3.10.0. So if you have installed a different version, then this number will be different. It doesn't matter which number you have, you guys can open up this folder. Okay, now here we can find the Python installation files. So what we have to do is we have to copy this location. To copy this path, one simple trick is we can take our cursor to this uh, navigation section and uh, we guys can see the files and folders that we have gone through to come to this location. What we have to do is we have to take the cursor uh, outside these uh, uh, folder names and we have to left click once. It will highlight the path. Then we can take our cursor on this path and we can right click and we can copy this path. Okay. After that, we can minimize this uh, folder. Now, what we have to do is we have to add the whatever the path that we have copied to the path environment variable. So we will click on the start button and we will search for edit environment variables. You will get this option which says edit environment variables for your account control panel. Click on that to open it up and then you will find user variables and system variables. Here we will uh, 
update the path in the user variables. Click on the path and then click on edit, then click on new and then right click here and then paste the path that you have copied and then add a backslash just like I have added here. After that click on the outside and after that click on new again. Again paste the path that you have copied, add a backslash and then you have to type in scripts SCRI PTS and then a backslash here IS yes is capital just like the way I have added here you need to add the path. Now one more thing that we have to do in Windows 11 operating system is uh, here if you find a path entry with user profile app data local Microsoft Windows apps listed here if this path is listed here then what you have to do is you have to click on that and you have to move it down so that it appears below the path that you have added right now. So this path which is user profile app data local Microsoft Windows apps should be below the path that we have added right now. Uh, you may have some other entries in here but make sure that uh, this Windows apps will uh, appear below the path that you have inserted. After that click on OK and click on OK and we have updated the path. Now let us make sure that everything is working properly. Click on the start button and search for CMD. Open up the command prompt and here type in python space minus minus version and hit the enter button you will find python version which is installed in your computer. So it means that you have updated the path environment variable properly. So this is it guys this is how you guys can set the path environment variable with python installation location. If you like this video hit the like button if you don't like it hit the dislike button if you want to say something then write that in the comment box for more tutorials like this do subscribe to the channel.